Sometimes you might come across Chinese sentences that are really confusing. You understand all the words, but you can't seem to understand the sentence. So in this video, let's untangle one Chinese sentence together. Let's start. So first, tell me what this sentence means. 我时差还没倒过来呢。我时差还没倒过来呢。there might be some words that are unfamiliar to you. For example, 时差 means jet lag. The difference in time is jet lag. And 倒 means to reverse something, 倒. But putting everything together, 我时差还没倒过来呢. What does this mean? Can you figure it out? It actually means I'm still jet lagged. 我时差还没倒过来呢. The key to understanding this sentence is knowing the word 倒时差倒时差 literally means to reverse the jet lag, which means to adjust to a new time zone. But you might ask, why is it reverse the jet lag? Well, imagine that you landed in China and uh, you have to adjust to the new time zone. Your night is now the day and the day is now the night. So you have to reverse day and night, right? You have to adjust to the new time zone by reversing day and night. So that's why we call it 倒时差, literally reversing the jet lag. For example, 他现在是不是在倒时差呢? 他现在是不是在倒时差呢? Is she adjusting to the new time zone? Is she jet lagged right now? Another example, 他经常出国, 倒时差不成问题. 他经常出国, 倒时差不成问题 不成问题 literally means it will not become a problem In this case, it means it's no problem 倒时差不成问题 She has no problem adjusting to the new time zone She has no problem with the jet lag Now let's go back to the original heart sentence 我时差还没倒过来呢 We know that 倒时差 is to reverse the jet lag But in this sentence, it becomes 时差倒 What's going on? Well, here, 时差 is actually the object, and 倒 is the verb. So we're putting the object before the verb. You might think of it as, I, as for the jet lag, I haven't turned it over yet. I, as for the jet lag, 我时差, I haven't turned it over yet. 还没倒过来呢. So here, the word 过来 translates to over, it's like saying, turn this over, right? When we say over, usually it means to uh, move something from some original place to a new place or change something to an original state uh, to a new state. So, 把它倒过来 means to turn it over, to actually produce a result to change its state. So that's what 过来 is expressing. It's like the English word over. And that's how the sentence works. 我时差还没倒过来呢? I, as for the jet lag, I haven't reversed it over yet. That means I'm still jet lagged. All right, now let's do some practice and see if you can understand the following sentences. What does this sentence mean? 我饭还没吃完呢. One means to finish, by the way. 我饭还没吃完呢. What does this sentence mean? It means I haven't finished eating yet. I haven't finished my meal yet. 我饭还没吃完呢. Next, 我话还没说完呢. 我话还没说完呢. What does this mean? That means I haven't finished talking yet. I'm not done talking yet. I haven't finished my words yet. 我话还没说完呢. 我 as for me, 话, my words, 还没说完呢, I haven't said them all yet. 我话还没说完呢, I haven't finished talking yet. All right, the last one. 我作业还没写完呢, 我作业还没写完呢, what does this mean? Right, I haven't finished my homework yet. 我作业还没写完呢。我作业还没写完呢。And that's it. In this video, we learned how to untangle this sentence 我时差还没倒过来呢。
It means I'm still jet lagged. If you're enjoying this, please give it a thumbs up and uh, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Thank you.